Yeah, what's up guys, Growing the Hobby coming back to you guys with another hockey break. My favorite box, there it is. Your favorite box, hopefully, the GTH box is back. We've got eight random packs thrown in here today, and hopefully they are going to be some, you know, delivering some fire here and stuff like that. Once again, the hockey gods maybe be with us. Uh, you know, I don't normally do it, but I'll show you guys the background cards very quickly, because I know it's not in frame to see the grade here, but I do want to show you guys my recently acquired... PSA 10, the Great 8 Alexander Ovechkin rookie card. Finally got me one of those to go with my other uh, on-card autograph young guns there. I'll have to pop that one up side by side with it again here very soon for everybody. And then this clear cut that I pulled out of one of these loose packs here uh, within the last couple months on the channel was a very, very nice one uh, from 14-15 Series 1. We got the clear cut captains out of 100 there. My man, Sid the Kid. So that was a sweet, sweet pull for me. And yeah, guys, let's get into the uh, loose pack break here today, I guess, whatever you want to call it and stuff. The GTH box, as you guys commonly know it as by this point. Uh, so we got a hobby pack of 2021 Metal Universe. We got a retail pack of 2021 Extended. Uh, 2021 OPG Platinum. I believe that's going to be a retail pack. Hobby pack of 93, 94 Series 2. 15, 16 Fleer Showcase. So that's obviously a hobby pack and some serious potential. To go with 1617 Fleer Showcase Hobby Pack as well. 2021 Metal Universe Hobby Pack again. And 1920 Series 1. That's a retail pack from the looks of it there. So pretty good lineup, at least in my opinion here. Hopefully we pull one or two nice, nice cards out of this. I'm going to start with the one that I'm least excited about, I guess, 9394. It's a hobby pack. But I like to reminisce sometimes and bring back those kind of memories of, you know, when I was a kid and stuff, opening these packs and cards up and stuff. And how about that one right off the bat? A very, very nice start. How the heck about that? Our SP insert card. They did one per pack uh, with these. Pretty much just got the best one you can get right there. Wayne Gretzky. How the heck about that? So that's awesome. That's right on top as well. We're not going to have the stickage and stuff like that uh, to the card. Yeah, the other cards might have paper loss. This one does not. And I'll tell you what, that is pack fresh. Very, very crisp. Nice one there. We're going to throw that in the old Gretzky PC right there. That's a nice card. Very, very nice. So set that aside there. All right, our base. Corey Millen. We're gonna have a little bit of a little bit of stickage and stuff like that. Uh, but that's to be expected with these. And then we have to do a whole lot of flips here, uh, because they did that to us back in the day here. Germont Titoff. Former penguin there, actually, if you didn't know that's Scott Pearson. Al McKinnis, if we can get him to cooperate here and just flip around there. And then we got Vitaly uh, Prokhorov. Our juniors cards, we should have two of these in here, I believe. Yep. Uh, Joel Bouchard and Ryan Sittler. And I guess, well, my gosh, how many? The amount of flips always drip. Look at that. How about Wendell Clark, by the way? Double, double, toil, and trouble, I guess. Ronnie Hextall, Penn's GM. Bill Holder. So nothing too, too crazy there, but uh, the Gretzky was definitely... A very pleasant surprise to start that pack off in a you know a very very nice pool. Um, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Let's do extended series since that is a retail pack here. Let's see what we can get in here. We can still get some really good stuff out of retail. I've seen some insane pulls out of uh, out of retail and actually out of extended series retail. It looks like we actually had a young gun there. I didn't mean to reveal it, but it looked like a young gun. All right, so Eric Cernick. Uh, felt really thick. I thought it was stuck to something. Matt Martin, Eric Halla, and our young guns, Jack Rathbone. One of the better ones, actually. Jack Rathbone there for the Canucks. And kind of that high school portraits, you know, picture there and stuff like that. If anybody wants to check out the back of that, be my guest. But we did get a young guns. I'll take that. Uh, Devin Tays, Tyler Pitlick, Nick Benino, and Patty Hornquist. A couple of former pens right there to bring up the rear of that pack. Um, what are we going to go to? I guess 1920 Series 1 is probably the obvious choice. So let's do that. 1920 Series 1. It's a retail pack, but I'm still looking for the Hughes Brothers. That would be nice. Adam Fox uh, is maybe going to be the runaway guy out of the, uh, the Young Guns from Series 1 anymore. All right, let's see what we can get here. So Jake Vertan starts us off. Adam Lowry. Anthony Duclair. Alexander Wenberg. Perhaps a base pack, it's looking like, guys. Lars Eller, Antoine Roussel, Mark Stone, and Alexander Radulov. So it looked like a pure base pack there, unfortunately. But that's okay. Uh, what are we going to do? I guess we'll do the platinum. 
save all the chances for the PMGs here in the last four packs. So our Platinum Pack, once again, this is going to be a retail one. Everything left is going to be Hobby. And chances for PMGs in all those Hobby Packs. But let's see if we can get something nice out of here. I love Platinum. Even the retail is a great version. Looks like we got something red. I think. Don't quote me, but it sure as heck looks red to me. And we'll see what we got. Pierre-Luc Dubois starts us off. Sweet Selections. Alex Alex. Good. I love that. And then our red. Mark Shifley. Mark Shifley. I don't think that's numbered. It's a red surge. Yep. Not numbered. I believe those are a Target exclusive. Red surge there. And last but not least, Pecorine. So, fun little four cards there. Love that OPG Platinum. All right, Metal Universe time, Flare Showcase time, whatever you want to word it as. We got the chance for PMGs in all four of these packs. 2021, we'll do both packs of these first, so you can get a PMG and auto or something like that. I prefer PMG, to be honest. But let's see what we can do. All right, Drew Doughty's going to start us off. Travis Konechny, Jonathan Taze, Carter Hart, J.G. Pajo, and it's going to be one of those prospects. A decent one, Michael DiPietro. Those are not numbered. And Jacob Slavin. Pack number two. Let's see what we can pull in here. Come on, let's get one PMG. And I don't think we have it. It looked like that was, uh, oh gosh, I can't remember the name of the insert off the top of my head, but it's going to be a non-numbered insert. Claude Giroux, kind of that cosmic look. Uh, I don't know why I can't remember that insert right now. Thomas Shabbat. Jonathan Marcheseau. Carey Price. And, oh, beautiful. That is not what I thought it was. <laughs> Let's try the other cards. Philip Kershev, rookie, and Mark Shifley, all-star. Heck, yeah, the throwback Metal Universe card with my man Sid the Kid. What a nice card. Heck, yeah, the retro throwback. Aptly named R1. Very, very nice. I'll take that all day long. That is a nice card. Pulled Connor Mac Daddy in this one uh, so far in this design and stuff like that. But uh, you have to get Sid the Kid. And that, that is a nice one for the PC. Very, very nice. I'll take that. Probably my favorite card of the break for sure at this point. All right. Fleer Showcase 1617 and 1516. 15, or I'm sorry, 1617. Austin Matthews. But I don't believe for the most part his stuff is live in here. Other than maybe like a. PMG or something. I can't remember off the top of my head. But let's see what we can get. Maybe we we'll get some luck. Who knows? Zach Parise is going to start us off. My gosh, I think we got a PMG, guys. Oh, boy. Ooh, we got a PMG. I am pretty much certain. I'm going to pull from the back real quick. JVR. Um, and then that's a decoy, guys. I'll just show it to you. I'm going to set that there. That has serious potential. Um, I'm actually going to save that for the end because I want to end with a high note and a bang. So let's do 15-16. Looking for Connor McDaddy in all his different forms here of rookies. I mean, you can get Red Glow, the Metal Universe inserts. You can get the PMGs. You can get the Rookie Patch Auto. You can get the Autos. I mean, there's just so many variants of uh, rookies that you can get in here for all the big rookies, not just McDaddy, but uh, that would be sweet. All right, so Stevie Eiserman's going to start us off here. Jacob Voracek, and I think we got a Metal Universe insert. It's a center, but it's not the one we were looking for. For the Panthers, Connor Brickley. So nothing nothing crazy doing there and stuff. Uh, Connor Brickley, Metal Universe there. Big old decoy. Sometimes you get two inserts in the pack, but that's not the case this time. Jordan Eberle and Guy Lafleur. All right, so moment of truth, guys. This could be huge, and I mean absolutely huge. Oh, boy. I'll tell you guys, if we pull a huge, huge name and it's a very, very low number PMG, uh, yeah, cover your ears. So Zach Parise starts us off, or doesn't start us off, but continues us off in this pack. Hank Zetterberg. All right, here we go, guys. I'm going to leave the decoy behind it. I don't even want to pull it up because I don't want to muck it up if it's something legit. Ah, right, well, so it's number eight. It is not going to be Austin Matthews. Can't tell. Is that a shark or not? I can't tell. Let's show oh, Joey Pavelski EX, not a PMG. <laughs> so completely embarrassed myself there as usual. But uh, that's the first one of these I actually pulled out of 1617. I'm used to pulling the EX uh, cards here out of like, uh, what was that, like 0809 Ultra and stuff like that. 
Um, that's the first I pulled there. All I saw was that green, and I'm like, oh, we got a green PMG, but uh, nope. Joe Pavelski. I mean, I'll still take it. It's a nice little, nice little pull there. Joe Pavelski EX. Nice green there. Kind of matches the Sharks a little bit, even though it's not quite blue. But, uh, yeah, Joe Pavelski. Oh, the disappointment there. Man, I thought we had a giant card to end with. But, yeah, there you go, guys. So we got Joe Pavelski. I'll show you guys the other ones I set aside. My favorite one of the breaks is definitely the Sid the Kid, the retro Metal Universe card there. The Jack Rathbone Young Guns and then the Wayno. How about that from uh, the SP insert there for the Kings. So that's my four faves. Sid the Kid's definitely going to be hands down my favorite one. And uh, that's pretty cool EX. I mean, I've never, like I said, I haven't pulled any of those out of uh, 16, 17 for sure or anything like that. All right, guys. Uh, even though I kind of screwed that one up and it wasn't a big PMG to end with, please do me a favor, like, subscribe, share, click that bell notification button to be notified of future videos. Lots more of them coming to you guys. As always, in the description below, you can find my email address, mailing address, and Instagram handle. Other than that, have a great day, a great night wherever you all are at, and we will see you next time.